A man accused in multiple stabbings appeared before a judge this morning. We first brought you this story as breaking news earlier this month after a crime spree in Seattle's Chinatown International District. Thanks for joining us for King 5 News at 5 o'clock. I'm Joyce Taylor. King 5's Natalie Swaby joining us live now. So, Natalie, what happened in court today? Well, the court ordered that the defendant undergo a mental competency evaluation before entering a plea. Tonight, he remains here at the King County Jail while the investigation into what happened continues. Mr. Lee is present in custody. Roland Lee, accused in an alleged stabbing spree, stood beside his attorney who told the court she doubts her client's competency. I base that primarily based on a fully delusional belief system that he struggles with. A police officer's camera captured Lee's arrest on November 8th, right after a series of stabbings. Surveillance video shows one of the attacks that prosecutors describe as unprovoked and random. In Chinatown International District, neighbors say it was part of two terrifying days with a total of 10 people stabbed. Lee was arrested for allegedly committing five stabbings near 12th and Jackson. Police say they're still investigating to see if he's connected to more. Court documents note that Lee's alleged victims were interviewed by officers. One described suddenly being punched really hard in the back before realizing he'd been stabbed three to four times. Another told police it felt like he was going to die. And a third said the pain blinded him and he eventually blacked out. Detectives collected three knives, part of the evidence that led to Lee in custody and in this courtroom today. His attorney told the judge she's represented him before in another case. But I think it's very different from the last time that I represented him and, and it's very concerning in terms of his ability both to assist me and to really understand what's going on from a rational perspective. Are you asking for an in-jail evaluation or I am. out of jail evaluation? In jail, please, Your Honor. It's a request granted in a court case just beginning to get underway. And the evaluation will determine if he's competent to enter a plea up next. There's a court hearing for December 16th, and right now he is being held at the jail on $2 million bail. Joyce? And what about the stabbing victims? Do we know how they're doing? Well, we know initially most of the victims went to Harborview Medical Center. I am told that all of the victims are expected to survive their injuries. Joyce? That's good news. Natalie Swaby in Seattle tonight. Thank you.